Hello everyone, I want to welcome you here at Car Connection in Little Ferry, New Jersey and today we're featuring this absolutely beautiful 2008 BMW 650 convertible. It's a very, very nice car. Very nice color. It's almost like an iridescent where it looks silver on top and then it can look like a gray. So it does have a, a very, very nice color. This car is very, very, uh, very well maintained. Um, let's go through it though. So this is a um, 4.8 liter V8, 360 horsepower with 360 pounds of torque. So it's a very torquey, peppy car. Uh, 14 miles a gallon in the city, 21 on the highway. So it's averaging roughly around at 16 miles per gallon. But what a nice car this is. Um, gonna point out a couple things here. So it does have matching Continentals all around. If you look at the rims all around, they're in very good condition. Okay, here's your passenger side front. Side of the mirror is also in great shape. These mirrors always on cars always get to, seem to get beat up a little bit. If you look down the side of the vehicle from the from the passenger side, look down the, down the side, you'll see it's very clean, very straight. Um, no dings, no dents, no paint peeling. Your passenger side headlight, bumper all the way across the grill to the driver's side headlight is clear and clean. Look at the driver's side here from the side. Look how nice and clean and straight it is. Here's your driver's side front tire and rim. Again, matching Continental. Look at the tread, look at the condition of the rim. Hood also very good shape, very, very minimal chip here. Nothing major, very, very minimal. The hood is in very good condition. Windshield, no chips, no cracks. Let's take a look at the top of the of the vehicle here before we put the top down later look how nice and straight it is it's in perfect condition no rips no tears let's pull back take a better look at the car from the side you see it's very clean again here's your driver's side mirror no chips let's pull back all the way to the driver's side rear tire and rim look how nice the tire is it is a matching continental look at the rim how nice it is let's pull back take a side view from the driver's side rear again look how nice and clean that paint is this, this vehicle does not look like it has any paint work. It's a very clean car. Uh, rear, driver's side, tail light, bumper, park back, backup sensors, all the way across to the passenger side, rear tail light, exhaust tips. Let's pull back, take a better look at the bumper, take a look at the trunk lid. <laughs> rear glass is in great shape. The top of the car is in great shape. Let's take a look at the vehicle from the passenger side view, rear. Look how nice and straight it is. Here is your last tire and rim, which is your passenger rear tire and rim. Okay, look how nice it is. Let's pull this vehicle. Let's pop the trunk. I guess we have to hold it down. There we go. Okay, so here's your... Um, rear trunk we got rubber mats here let's make sure we got the spare tire which i checked before we do have it it's just a pain in the ass to lift all this stuff up okay here's your here's your uh lug nut all your stuff uh your tools um your tow hook extra fuses uh the battery um it does have a uh, chrome front plate Take a look, pull from the side, take a better look at the vehicle from the side before I start demonstrating stuff. Very, very nice car. Okay, I'm gonna lock the doors at this time. Okay, they're already locked. Okay, so this does recognize the fob. So the door's locked. I do it once, it unlocks, picks up the, the lock and uh, it unlocks the door. So we know that this is working fine. It's recognizing the key. Okay, here's your front view of of the uh the i'm sorry the uh, passenger view of the front seats all right take a look at the front seat very nice condition let's make sure the power seat does work okay it does it works from here too okay let's pick it up let's look at the back seat very nice condition okay let's look at the dash the dash is in great shape the middle console everything here is very nice the inside underneath the, the liner is nice. Vehicle is clean, definitely not a smoker. It does have the original mat, original mat in the back here also. Pick it up, got the original mat back there. 
front driver's uh, passenger side door panel is in great shape. Let's shut the door. Let's do it on the other side. Let's lock it. Okay, so we know the door lock is locked. One side, one time, and then it unlocks so we know it's working well. Here's your driver's side door panel in very nice condition. All the buttons, side vents side vent there as well i think i looked at it let's take a better look at the dash let's go all the way up to the top and take a look at the dash let's pull back look at the steering wheel steering wheel is in very nice shape it does have a nice cover on it however the wind the steering wheel is in good condition so but it's a nice look it does match a lot of the stuff here it's pretty nice let's take a look at the front seats from the driver's side view the driver's side seat let's check the uh Power seat is working. Let's check it from here. So we know it's working from here. Let's lift it up. Let's take a better look at the rear seat from the driver's side. Look how nice that seat, original mat. Push the seat back just a little bit. All right, so we looked at everything from the outside. Let's get inside, let's put the top down and let's make sure and see how this car starts. It does have push start. So the car did start up right away. The heat is working. I had it warmed up just to make sure the heat was working. So it's not totally hot, but it's enough to get the heat to work so we can check it. So the heat is working. Uh, here's your heated seats. All these functions here work. If you know this here, I'm gonna hit the DTC button. It comes up. That's a little Ozzy playing in the background. We're gonna shut it down. Uh, but you can see the radio does work. That is the CD player. Let me push the CD. Let's just pull it out and let's go through the, uh, the entertainment since we're in the entertainment. Let's put the radio so we can see this is the radio now. Okay, so we know the radio is working. CD just went back in. So everything here, the entertainment system working. The system works great. No cracking speakers. It's very loud. Um, We'll let the Aussie CD uh, load up and then we'll play some Aussie in a little bit. Um, all right, so let's see what we got here. We do not have any warning lights on the dash. 86,000 miles. Here's your left directional, right directional. Horn works great. Let me put the seat back. Why wow, the seat's back all the way? I didn't realize my legs are as long as they are. Okay, uh, let's see. Okay, we got some Aussie playing in the background. Let's shut, let's shut off the heated seats. Um, okay, so you can see here the parking. As I put the parking assist, you can see everything is functioning. So let's get rid of that. Uh, let's shut this heat down. Whew, it's getting hot in here. Okay, so now what we're going to do is I'm going to put it on cold. And I'm going to put the AC on. Let's make sure the AC is working. AC is coming out very cold instantly. So we know all this stuff is working. Okay. Um, so here are the hazard lights. Uh, here are the door locks. Up, down, up, down. So everything here is functioning the way it should. I'm going to shut the vents down. The vents are not working. Turn them up. The vents are working. Same thing here. Shut the vents down. These BMWs, I want to make sure everything works on them because they get a little finicky sometimes and things, but everything is working here. Okay, so let's shut the heat off. Let's shut it off, get it. But okay, we're off right now. Okay, so here are your climate controls right here. By activating this, the onboard menu came up. But let's go back to it. So communication, everything's right here. Phone, um, let's go back to um, entertainment. So here are all your functions. All right, CD, aux. Uh, it, this vehicle does have Bluetooth, as you can see when I went to communication. It shows you the Bluetooth option, okay? Uh, let's go to climate. So here are all your climate controls. Okay, so this is working, and there's your navigation. So your navigation, uh, please insert 
navigation DVD. So the DVD is not in the unit, but the unit is working. Let's try the windows. Driver's side front. Driver's side rear. Passenger side front. Passenger side rear. Okay, the only thing left here is the top. So let's put the top down. So with the one button, it should do everything. The windows went down. Okay, so as you can see, it's putting everything down. Let's let it go through the, through the whole uh, circuit. Top goes down, and then the windows should come all up. So there's the rears, the fronts, and we just completed the circuit, okay? So right now, we got the top down. Let's take a walk around. Let's look at the car. Nasty looking from the back. That's my favorite view of this car from the back with the top down and the back window up. So this has a, the back window that goes up. Let's go look around again. And then we're gonna go back inside the car and we're gonna put the top up. Okay, Okay. now let's do the reverse order. Windows go down, top comes up. Back catch, the lid. Okay, now we're shutting and the windows are gonna come up and we just completed the circuit. Okay, so. We just completed everything, all the diagnostics, meaning all the gadgets in here, heat, everything, everything on his car is working. There's not one thing except for this button. Let's check it out. Let's press sport, see what it does. Sport. So this is the sport suspension. So yeah, it, it, all you gotta do is hit it when you're driving. You can see it right here, the button. You see how it lights up, sport, right there. So I went through everything, everything. I even tried all these things, the horn, everything on this car is working. This car is a very well-maintained car. It's a beautiful car. Let's rev it up now. Let's listen to this engine. Let's take it outside. Okay, that's a nice sounding engine. Let's get underneath the hood and let's listen to this engine compartment and let's Listen to this engine a little nicer, a little deeper. Okay, here's your 4.8 liter. Look at that engine bay, how nice and clean it is. Listen to that engine. Quiet, no wheel, no, no pulley noises, no belt squealing. Just a beautiful, beautiful car. Okay, once again, we got a 2008 650 convertible BMW. Give us a call, 201-440-1323. If you want to view specific pics of this vehicle and this video, you can view them right there at www.carconnectiononline.com. When you get to our site, click the vehicle of your choice. If it's not this one, when you click the vehicle, you'll bring, it'll bring you to a specific page, which will have four tabs, one for photos. So the photos on our, on our site will be more entailed and a lot more than what you'll see on Marketplace, CarGurus, Cars.com, because they limit us. But on our website, we put unlimited pictures. So this car is going to have at least 60 pictures on our, uh, on our website. Uh, the next tab you'll see is um, video, which is videos like this that we provide on all our vehicles. The other the next tab will be auto check, which is a free VIN check that we also provide on all our vehicles. And the last one is apply for loan. So you can apply, on loan, uh, apply for loan directly online in any one of our vehicles. If you have any questions regarding our finance options, call us at 201-440-1323. And last but not least, we offer warranties on all our vehicles, including our motorcycles. Everyone stay safe and thanks for viewing this video.